everybody back with a new episode of Once Upon a Time. Last episode was so good. Incredible, even. Uh, seeing Rumple and Belle's love story in one big episode was lovely. Uh, and, you know, I wish we could have seen more of Belle learning to trust him completely and him staying away from the darkness all this time and all of that stuff that I wanted to happen kind of just, you know, got wrapped up in this one little episode. And if that's all we got of it, I'm grateful for it because it was beautiful. And, uh, Belle realized that she had to live her life and die. So Rumpel can eventually meet her again by giving up the dark power to the guardian. So that's how he's in the realm with them or that's how he got to the realm with them and is now in Hyperion Heights. So now he's awake thanks to Tilly, who I really liked. I love her, in fact. And, you know, she said ex-girlfriend, and, and, you know, sometimes girls call their friends girlfriend, so I wasn't sure if that meant anything. But you guys said that she is a, a gay character, so I'm so excited by that, you know? Bring in Mulan. Um, I want her to have a happy ending, you know? Uh, Ruby went off with Dorothy, so I'm just really excited that there's another woman-loving woman character on the show. I'm so here for it. So I'm really excited by that. I really liked her character and how she helped Rumple remember everything. Had to shoot him, in fact, to do so. But I really like her. And uh, I don't like Ivy being into Henry, though, which is where the, the episode ended off. Not excited by that. But I am excited to get back into this episode because I am really enjoying season seven. So this episode's called Greenbacks, which is like slang for money. I don't know what that would mean, so let's get into it. What's up with this? You see belief as something solid, dependent, something easily removed with one singular blow. You have to uproot it. Leave Lucy alone. So I sever her belief by the root. Now, which root do I begin with? Probably Henry. I just came to give Lucy this. I love a beignet. I was to make without my favorite taste tester. I was just talking about you. You were and why? I was going over your rental agreement. Oh no! Decided to You're starting with her. Eight percent starting this month. You want to push us out? We will just push right back. Mm hmm She's a fighter. We know. My daughter Tiana and I would like to welcome you to our. Oh my God! That's Robin Gibbons. Yes. Icon. I don't know how it got up. Too bad that Daddy's no longer alive to save you and your mother from ruin. It's so sad. Priscilla, I want to like you, but you make it real hard. Heart like this, I will find a good man, brave and heroic like Father was. Well, Froggy, a prince who will save us. <laughs> You're gonna save yourself, girl. I think that Ivy may surprise you. You know, she got a taste of standing up to her mother. She might be willing to help us. I, mean, I, I don't know about home. that. Believe me, it doesn't end with you happy. Listen to your mother. So your life saving idea is 50 pounds of flour mixed with 100 eggs and 20 cups of sugar. Beignets. I may have dipped into the bread jar. Dipped? How much is a dip? Uh, a pinch or, or a dash? Uh -huh. All of it. This is better work. He was drunk. Melfi. Well, I'll turn some people into jackasses. I can't invest in any more of your crazy schemes. Crazy schemes. Oh, well, everything's already been bought, so. You're a dreamer, and I love you for it, but I need a job. I believe the princess is here to see me. I do not. Now scurry off, unless you'd rather slither or hop. Ooh. Princess, enchanté. I tip with the hat from Dr. Vasily. The king began to take more and more from the people. The wealth dried up like a raisin in the sun. Ooh. And that's why you've come to me. Don't think for one second that I wouldn't trade in my own daughter for an actual assistant. She it's what? Time you 
Shut up and earn your job title. You're never gonna please her. Henry, it's Ivy. Call me back if you still want dirt on my mother. Ooh. I have a pretty good idea where to start. <laughs> She's ready to play ball. So I can't tell what's worse. The fact that you believe her or that you're falling for her. No, don't say that. Man, there's a much better single mother option staring you in the face. Uh, where are you going? Uh, to the bathroom. Unless you feel compelled to hold my hand in there, too. <laughs> They still have the same dynamic, even if he doesn't know. No, you can't do that. You are overstepping bounds, Mom. I have a small addition to it. For old McDonald. No, I'm thinking jazz, luring people into a popcorn light lit food truck. We park it at festivals and movie nights. The food truck is a smart tonight. idea. Buckets of these guys. Since you're here, I think I'll take those earrings at a severe discount. Perhaps I'll hold my own auction. Your legs should get a few coins, seeing as they'll soon be half off. <laughs> a nice joke. <laughs> you don't get one. You know that place selling beignets? Wreck it. If your lost girl was drawn there, I'd hate to meet whatever he will show his face of now. Did we know his daughter? Is she a Disney character? Thank you so much for pushing me. I needed a nudge. Yeah, well, that's what best friends do. And I think today we proved our business is on fire. <laughs> Uh, oh my god. How'd they do that? Oh my god, it grew so fast. I'd like to see you again tomorrow. That would be nice. I don't know about this guy. <laughs> he took it. I thought it was missing. Stop right there. <laughs> he took my true love captive. He separated us in the cruelest of ways. I'm a man, and I love his frog. frog? <laughs> Facilier promised he would let her free. I don't ever want to see your face again. Go! I mean, I do feel bad for him. Your father's legacy isn't this little prize. It's in you. I just want what's best for you and Lucy. What is best is not giving people hope that life will get better when it never does. Oh. You don't live in the real world, Sabine, but I do. There's enough money in there for two months' rent. Should be enough time for you to find a new job. And a new roommate. No! Well, if you're so eager to destroy your mother, prove it. Fine. I will. Yeah, I mean, I believe her. I think she realizes what kind of person her mother is. Whenever mother comes up here, she's always home. How'd she get in there without her fingerprint? This isn't growing up, it's running away. Tell her, Lucy. Oh, sorry. I know you want it, so take it. Get whatever pathetic amount of gold you can. And in exchange, you want me to... Hand over the woman you kidnapped. Aw, you're helping. <laughs> You mean, uh, Nothing's transformed me. That's who I always was. I just didn't realize it. As a gift for your part in my liberation, I'll let you go. Just this once. Ooh! I'm not leaving without her. <gasps> you made a voodoo doll? So good to be back. See you soon, princess. You should have just taken your ruby and gone. That was a fair deal. You did it. See your food truck. <gasps> yes. Because they'll have me. Because you're right, Sabine. Because that is what best friends do. We all gotta make that rent back real quick. Not each other. I finally figured out I don't need a hero. If I can be a hero. Mm -hmm, you sound mm -hmm. like your father. About my lady love. I kind of misled you before. Again? About what? Uh, 
You're both frogs? What? <laughs> what? Last of the beignets for you and your buddies. I'm kind of shipping this. Get us the food truck. No problem. This is part of this one's in pound auction. Damn it. We got a problem. Who are you? Someone's looking for the girl. Who are you working for? Is this more Victoria shit? Not all daughters are created equal. Yeah, it's clear you have a favorite. It's embarrassing watching you flailing around Ivy. And thanks for makeup. The worst. Listen, I answered a text on your phone from Ivy and met her at Belfry Tower. Wait, 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 wait. I know. You it was wrong. I found this. And I have never owned clothes like those in my life. That's me. <laughs> oh my god! Look at little Henry. You're the one that asked me to hide from her, <gasps> from Ronnie. <gasps> you scared the hell out of me. You're working with her. Do they trust you? <gasps> yes, of course. Are you kidding? They trust me as much as mother does. Cool that she is. Your mother thinks she sees and knows all. You did a good job of convincing her she's in charge. What can I say? I'm a clever girl. My sweet Ivy. You know I'll do just that. Good. And don't call me Ivy. It's Drizella. So you remember who you are. Okay, I did not expect that. <laughs> Ivy is a player here. Um... And is not on her mother on her mother's side at all, even before this episode where she got dressed down so much. So wow, she's working with a witch. That's not what I expected. But she is trying to garner favor with Ronnie <laughs> and Henry, who now know that their mother and child or the picture sort of makes it look like that. Which, you know, it's going to be difficult to explain the time differences. Like, she looks exactly the same, and Henry's a full-ass adult now. So, I'm sure they're not going to be believing it. Um, but that should be enough to wake them up, shouldn't it? <laughs> I don't know. No Mr. Gold here. I guess that's understandable since the last episode was so heavily focused on him. But a big focus on Sabine, which I love. I love her... I love her resilience and her dreams and her relationship with Jacinda. I'm glad they patched things up and I'm glad they got a food truck. I would be first in line for those beignets and getting to see her side of it too, of how she kind of figured out that she could be the hero and help that frog <laughs> and his froggy love. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Um, but I don't think it's the last we saw of that guy who took off um, to whatever world he was able to go to with that ruby. So that's still probably a problem. But yeah, Tiana slash Sabine, love her to death. And I'm glad they're going forward with their dream of the food truck. And Lucy helping with the logos was really sweet. And... I just really like that. I like them. I like them as new characters. Uh, seven seasons in. Um, it's impressive that they're able to have me care about them. And I do. I really like them. And of course, I hate Victoria. But I think that Ivy might be just as bad. And she's got her... I You know, I, I feel like... I feel like Henry finding out that Ronnie did that is going to make him try to go with her more. Because usually if you push someone in one direction, they're going to go in the other direction even more. And that's not the right thing to do because of what she's got cooking up with the witch. I don't know what's going on there, but that's pretty interesting. But yeah, I, I really did like this. I like that we got Tiana's backstory and her hero, heroism. I really like that. And then them, even though they're... Mr. Klux got burned down. They were still able to regroup. She grabbed the money and 
they, you know, got a new plan and I'm really excited about that for them. So yeah, good episode. Thanks for watching guys. I'll be back soon.